The decision that shocked the world, a former first overall pick in the NFL, generational talent, walking away from the game he loves. I'm in pain. I'm still in pain. It's been four years of this injury pain rehab cycle. With every injury sapping away his strength, both physically and mentally, he finally said, enough is enough. It's taken my joy of this game away. A laundry list of injuries from a lacerated kidney and a concussion to torn muscles and sprained ankles and the mental wounds no one ever sees. But it seems like they all wore him down. It's just an accumulation of all those things. Dr. Grant Morrison sees injured athletes like Luck every day. What can you say about the pain that people go through to recover from these injuries. It sounds like it's a real grind. I mean, it's like a chronic illness, like diabetes or cancer. I mean, you never ever feel normal and never feeling normal, never feeling healthy, and you just wanted to walk away from all that. It's sometimes months, years of recovery. Right, right. For example, a, a major surgery like an ACL reconstruction, so it takes a surgeon a couple of hours. The rehab can take over a year. So that's a lot of grinding effort day in, day out to try to feel normal again. And just trying to mentally get themselves back in that frame of mind to go back to the same thing. Right, where they got hurt in the first place. That's gotta be a tough challenge to overcome. Not to mention the pressures of being a professional athlete with teammates, coaches, and countless fans counting on you. When they come back from an injury, we hear this great, amazing perseverance story, but we don't see what it took to get them back on the field. We don't see what it took. We don't see the hours and hours they spend in therapy or with the athletic trainers and the time they just are miserable. They're hurting. Many fans are also hurting after hearing the news, some using humor to help themselves get through it. Others boot him off the field during Saturday night's game. A few even took off his jersey in protest. This wow. is the type of impact we're talking about. Fellow players were also quick to judge. OJ posted this video on Twitter, calling Luck out minutes after drafting him on his fantasy football team. You, you, you could have retired an hour and a half ago before I picked you in my fantasy picks. I mean, what did I do, man? Other players stepped in to defend his decision, saying they get it. The pressure and pain are real and health is more important than money. You got to respect the person and not make a judgment on his toughness. I think we need to take a step back and not be worried about our fantasy football teams and let him make that decision based on his own comfort level. The timing of his retirement has also irked a few fans, some questioning why now with the season just two weeks away, why didn't he wait? Lux says the thought of retirement never crossed his mind until about two weeks ago with his ankle not healing as fast as he had hoped. He says he started feeling the same way he did back in 2016 when he played through pain the entire season and he promised himself back then that if he ever felt that way again, he'd call it quits and he did.